Hello buddy, what is up? It's me, your boy, Abid Joseph, and I know usually whenever I do videos like this that I use the face cam, but you know, I just got out of the shower and stuff, and I don't, you know, my hair is kind of messed up and everything, so I'm doing the video like this. Now, today I'm going to make a video on what killed Dynasty Warriors, and uh, I'm going to go into very great detail about this, but I mean, if you're not a fan of Dynasty Warriors or, re or you've never heard of it, this will explain why some people of today may not even know what Dynasty Warriors is because I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna explain what killed the game. All right, Dynasty Warriors, the first one. Let's go into, mm, yeah, that that chaos that you never hear anybody talk about is a PS1 classic. Now, Dynasty Warriors 1 was kind of like Tekken and all that rice and stuff, but you actually had weapons and stuff, and you fought, and you went through levels and good stuff like that. Yeah, let's just go ahead and, you know, skip that because, yeah, yeah no one wants to talk about that. All right, now the, thing, now the thinking game that I played of Dynasty Warriors is the Dynasty Warriors 3. And I heard Dynasty Warriors 2 is a lot like it, so I'm not going to go into Dynasty Warriors 2. I'm going to go by off what I know. Dynasty Warriors 2 uh, 3 was a fun game that you had where, you know, you got to actually roam around the map and everything. And, you know, you had strong characters like Lubu killing you whenever you'd very first start out the game. Yeah. Who doesn't love getting obliterated? I mean, a lot of kids today couldn't handle something like that. But back in the day, I mean... He got killed by Lu Bu, and, uh, you know, it wasn't it wasn't easy, you know. Like, as a beginning character, I mean, like, hit you three times with his Masu move, and you're done for. It doesn't matter, like, how strong you think you are, Lu Bu would kill you. And a lot of us kids, you know, back in the day actually had to skip Lu Bu because he kind of put the smack down on us. Now, I know got some of you guys are saying, what were you like? three or one whenever that game came out i think it came out in 2001 maybe 2003 and i'm like well guys you know i played the games when i was seven and stuff all right all right now the third game that i've uh played not gonna go into the fourth one i heard that one was pretty you know not the best um dynasty warriors 5 now dynasty warriors 5 what i think was one of the most popular ones there you had you had characters you had the outfits just right you had the moves getting to where they were op and everything you had zhao yu with the long hair and talking about how the girls loved him you had lu bu coming out there stronger than ever before you had dong zhuo actually looking like that rich leader guy before you turn him into a freaking whale you had Mang Hu, you know, looking kind of like he was actually Indian instead of looking like he was a normal uh, Chinese guy. You had him looking like he was actually a tribal. All the detail and everything was fine. And, you know, you had more people in white and everything. You know, you actually had the cow family. People actually starting to show up like cow Ren and stuff like that. And now you guys are wondering, whoa, like what could have killed Dynasty War? It sounds like it was doing pretty good, you know, bringing in all these characters and everything. Well... Here's what killed the franchise. Dynasty Warriors 6. Now that you're saying, well, oh, Dynasty Warriors 6, um, how could it have been much worse? I mean, you just said 5 was like one of the best ones. What could have changed it so fast? Well, guys, the simple matter of the fact is they took everything from the previous Dynasty Warriors games, scrapped it, and said, oh, yeah, let's just go ahead and do a whole new thing. You know, let's say, you know, Zhao Yu used to, you know, have his hair down and be wearing these really royal clothes and had a sword. Yeah, we're just going to change that, and we're going to change them into these weird-looking clothes that are more modern. And we're going to give him a poll. Oh, Lu Bu, let's put him in an all-leather clothing, make the long hairy head that everybody loves way shorter, and give him two, uh, like, weird, um, pike things that are nothing like the old ones. The only person they really kept was Zhao Yu, but everybody else they changed. And, Zhao, and like I said, Lu Bu's wearing, like, leather clothing. There was no time back in the ancient Chinese times that they was wearing leather clothing. I don't remember. He literally looks like he's a biker, okay? And they need to, like, stop that. I don't know what they were thinking. Anyway, guys, that's just, like, a little bit of my thought on it. Um, I'm gonna get out of here because, uh, you know, I just, you know, went ahead and told you what killed it. Don't even have to go any further into it. I said it was gonna go deeply de uh, detailed into it. I kind of did. Uh, I, those few reasons I gave you were deep detailed enough. Anyway, guys, of course, hope you did enjoy, and I will see you all in the next video. Until then, peace out, and have a good one. <laughs>